Gotti. This ah! is uh, oh Polish Jesus Christ. Uh, the this is now a hijacking fry. <laughs> Anywho, happy Sunday evening, everybody. I hope everyone's had a good weekend thus hello far. There. Um, hello there, sir. Um, uh, no, you don't have to lay off. It's funny. <laughs> um, I know Noxler had a great week. He just got back from his vacation. Um, and everyone else is in here, too. It's crazy. Uh, so, as I'm sure if people were watching chat, they would have noticed, unless you just showed up and, and may have missed it, um, there is a new channel point redemption goal we're having for the, um, uh, like the behind the scenes, uh, the how to, how do I do what I do on this side of the camera? And I figure what we'll do is we'll make it like cap it at like 30 minutes or something just to kind of open a stream up and I'll go do something else uh, so, yeah, so feel free to if you're if that's something that's interesting to you go ahead and uh, you can do up to 2,000 channel points a day uh, otherwise use them however you feel uh, but Cheek, I'm doing very well thank you for asking thank you for the uh, donating the 2,000 Megger's donating 2,000 as well uh, sounds like people are interested in it so that's pretty cool um so, I wanted to uh, I wanted to be funny if we got to level up level if we got to follower number four twenty, but of course uh, it, it happened. Apparently, let's see, about two hours ago, we got number four nineteen yesterday, and then three in a row two hours ago. Jesus, you used all your bias already. Oh, Got to keep watching, then, dude. That's how you get them. You think it's awesome? Oh, cool, cool, great. Um, so, um, for those that don't know who Twy is, Twilight Soul, um, Twy was having a Steam giveaway uh, on Friday during a 10 hour stream that was insane. And I ended up winning a, uh, a Steam gift card. It was like 10 bucks, I was like, sick. Now, I was thinking about what to use it on, and, I mean, everybody was just, like, peppering me with, are you going to play Madison? Are you going to play Madison? Are you going to play Madison? And normally what I do is I kind of hold off, and I'll wait a couple weeks, see what people think, and, you know, whatever, and I go on with it. Is that new? Yes, it dropped three days ago. Um, so, it was 35 bucks, and the last time I bought a horror game... By an independent developer that was $35 was a game called Visage. And that game scared the holy fucking shit out of me. And uh, I was talking to Baloney Boy uh, last night. Uh, for those who don't know Baloney Boy, um, he is also a horror streamer. And uh, you probably recognize him from Sane TBD on YouTube if you watch those uh, collab uh, compilation videos. Collaboration videos. Compilation videos. Of uh, jump scares. He was like, yeah. <laughs> There's the hot cocoa. It's very similar to Visage, I've been told. I mean, you've played a bit of it, too. So, I mean, I guess you could say it would be similar. Um, so, Polish. I don't know too much about it. What I do know is there's no animal abuse in this one. So, that's the good news. Um, but I will read to you, my friend, what they have here in Steam. Madison is the first person psychological horror game that delivers an immersive and terrifying experience. Okay. With the help of an instant camera, connect the human world with the beyond. Take pictures and develop them by yourself. Hey, we're doing that and Martha is dead, aren't we? Solve puzzles, explore your surroundings, and most importantly, survive. Yeah, this dropped three days ago from Bloodiest Games. They were the developer and the publisher, so you figure it's an indie. Um, that is where the money went to, yes. <laughs> Um, so I want to finish up Martha is Dead tonight. I feel like we're pretty close to the end. And if we're not, then holy shit, they got me. Joke's on me. And I wanted to start a little bit earlier tonight. Normally we're about 10, 10 30 Eastern and it's a few minutes past 9 p.m. Eastern, which is great. Uh, cause I want to be able to give Martha is Dead its time so we could play 
enjoy the end of it, and then whatever time we have left tonight, as long as I can go, um, ow, what the fuck did I just step on? I still keep finding little fucking splinters of wood from my old chair just hidden in the carpet. I think I just stepped on one. Um, but yeah, so I want to make sure we get that done. Martha's dead, that is, and then we'll jump right into Madison after that. Uh, with minimal delays, no commercial breaks, hopefully not. Um, but first, uh, what can we do? What can we do? It. Yeah. So we're gonna go back to the classic sour not sorry beer, the one and only Octafant. It's like you take an uh, octopus and an elephant and put it together. Which I guess is kind of Cthulhu. It is a uh, sour IPA, uh, hence why Octofant is the name. You take two things that are very different and smash them together, and you get something that tastes like fucking sweet tarts. Uh, and his OG version before he started rolling it out, well, actually the first generation, the first release of this beer, commercially, was like the OG, and then it stopped. He changed it. He dropped back the uh, the alcohol content in it. it used to be eight and a half percent. This beer would fuck you up. <laughs> like if it wasn't the heartburn that got you, it got you, you know, right in the BAC level. Looks like my mother after a night out. Good lord. Fry no, no, <laughs> no more tentacles. So cheers to you all for being here early. I appreciate you all. Thank you so much. Oh yeah. Oh. And um, on its sour meter, this is the second highest sour it gets. They can only get a little bit more sour than this, and this one's pretty goddamn sour. But yeah, this is no longer 8% or 85 whatever it was. I know he, yeah, he dropped it down to a, a meager 6 and a half. <laughs> At least now you can have, like, two and not get worried about it. Granted... Um, this one in particular, I'll probably have one, and that's it. Because it's 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 sour, but it's a good sour. It's like I said, it's um, if you remember like sweet tarts, it's like the shock tarts. That's what I was thinking of. Uh, but yeah, now that we've gone through a few songs, um, I'm thinking <clears throat> that it's time we get into this goddamn game. That was my favorite candy ever. You'd fucking love this beer then, dude. <laughs> yeah, it's the sugar knock, bitch. Butt cheek. Thank you so much for the 200 biddies, buddy. Appreciate you. Let's give a... Uh, actually, since, since I have it right in front of me, don't worry about it, uh, Fry. I'm going to give butt cheek a nice shout out. If you're not following butt cheek, now's the goddamn time. Skinny hallway, skinny hallway. I feel that. This isn't good. It's gonna happen. I don't even know what game this is. I already know. It's, I know it's gonna happen. Okay. Oh, or not? <laughs> I was ready for something to come popping out, vibing with. <laughs> is that vile plume? <laughs> um, shit. So yeah. So appreciate you, butt cheek. I mean, let, let's give shouts to everybody here that I know of that uh the streams. We got. We got the. Best fucking mod in the game. It's just kind of dark and spooky now. <gasps> oh. Holy moly, okay, I think we found a ghost. I think so too. We got Twy up in here again. I'm gonna need oh, the Doom gameplay. Right I did go right through him. That sucked. Um, even though I know he's only got one clip on here, Polish does occasionally stream. Check him out. I guess our job is done and we can safely go home without having Even attacked. though it's Doc Islands. But do we want to find the bone? <laughs> uh, we got Demon Dragon in the house. He's having some technical difficulties tonight, which sucks. But uh, we'll give him a shout out anyways. He's a mainstay here. No mercy. No mercy, he says. Why 
Okay, they must they must spot out the enemy. Uh, we got Noxler returning. <laughs> That's cursed. <laughs> what was that shit? I'm sorry you guys had to see that. <laughs> Yo, that was funny as hell. Uh, Yeah, get more streaming going in soon. You got it, my dude. Absolutely. I'm slowly catching up on chat here. Okay, cool, cool, cool. All right. Um, without further ado, Martha is motherfucking dead. And she has been for a few days in game, too. Like, I think it's been like four or five days now. Ah, <clears throat> oh, man. I feel like a kid at McDonald's with a $10 bill and I order, want to order nothing but off the dollar menu. You know, back when those the thing. Yeah, so um, speaking of cursed things, uh, the puppet shows, not fun at fucking all. All right, what do we need to do? Um... <sighs> Una sola divinazione al giorno. Oh, I already have this one per day. That's right. Shit. All right, I need to look at, is it K? Yes. Call Don Attilio, okay. Find a watering can for that thing out there. I'm gonna call more number, Don Attilio, okay. The Gothic line uh, is loop the phone near the stream. I haven't done that yet. We've done everything else though, so that's pretty good. I have like 10 to 30 minutes left. That's, that's quite a jump. <laughs> Let's go call Don Don Julio, whatever the fuck his name is. Um, what's his number again? Don Julio. Oh, Don Attilio. <laughs> Don Julio. Ah! 6938. Let's give him a ringy dingy. Uh, excuse me. Oh, well, wherever, wherever you are, Iron Maiden's gonna get you, no matter how far. See the blood flow watching it shed up above my head. Iron Maiden wants you for dead. Hello, Satan. Welcome in, bud. We're gonna call him Don Attilio right now. Don Attilio, chi è? Mm. W. Padre, mi aiuti. Sono tutti morti. Il babbo, la mamma, tutti. Giulia, vieni subito da me, non stare da sola, è pericoloso. Vieni in paese, potrai stare con me e mi racconti tutto, va bene? That's probably a good idea. Yeah. Va bene, padre. Ma prima voglio giocare un po'. Giulia, non fare fessioni. What? Vieni subito. I don't want to play with your paese. fucking puppets anymore, Giulia. My puppet theater is the only thing left. But it does say to take the bike and go to San Cassiano. Okay, so I'm not going to go play with them. Instead, what we're going to do... I'm going to go leave the photo near the stream. I'll call 1185, see if this... Because it's the only thing that hasn't crossed off there. It said I couldn't call them earlier. I should call and be like, yeah, my dad's dead. Bye. <laughs> No more puppy cooking. I mean, I hope not. And five. They could have made the numbers on the fucking kid. Not now. Okay. Flowers are at that other place there. Um. At like the the tomb or whatever. All right, so we'll go and drop off um the photo near the stream. So I think we just go through the front door, which is this way. <clears throat> so we'll get down to the uh, the stream. We'll leave the photo I took of something I don't quite remember. I wish I knew where the watering can was. Also, okay. Planes flying low. Oh shit! They said the war was close, but god damn. All 
fine. I'm not going to take the bike yet. Oh, yeah, that's right. A bomb hit our fucking church. So I think it's, it's over the bridge and to the left. I just don't remember which picture I'm supposed to put there, but I'm sure the previous objective will tell me. And I'll be reminded on what I need to put there. What? I want to... Motherfucker. I'm going to get over there whether you want me to or not. Oh yeah, this is where I buried my mother. Ha <laughs> ha! God damn it, I can't get there, huh? Um, that doesn't make sense, though. Look at the map. Where do I go? It doesn't show me where to put that anymore? That doesn't make any sense. Let me zoom out. Yeah, I have to get over the bridge. So allies are nearby bombing you guys. Nice. Oh, yeah. that's That makes sense for what was going on. All right, I'll, if I can control the bike, great. If it's going to cut see me past it and I miss out on the objective, that's kind of shitty. Please don't die. End of game. Credits roll. That'd be hilarious. I can move a little bit faster, please. All right, just, just let me... Hello? Please let me do it myself. Yes! I hold shift to go a little bit faster. Damn! Here we go. You know, I'm gonna do a tail whip. Where's the jumps at? I'm like fucking Dave Mira. Da 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 BMX, now that was a game. Yeah! I can't turn it off, dude. Otherwise, I probably would have. But I mean, they're not going to randomly bomb someone on a fucking bike. At least I hope not. Alright, cool, I didn't have to select the picture. Ecco fatto. La fotografia è dove deve essere. La fotografia. Use the telegraph. Fuck, I have to go back, don't I? Yep, alright. Let me go use the telegraph. I just want to get this done. I feel like it's very important for the story and the ending. And I took all the time and effort of getting the photograph done while my mom was in the fucking room and blocking me out. And I had to, like, sneak past her and shit. I mean, now the bitch is dead. She was a bitch. Dad got killed by soldiers, or at least I think he was killed by soldiers. Because Julia's fucking crazy. And I, and I understand why. It doesn't make it right, but I can understand why. What we learned at the end of last episode. Of course they would. They're Americans. Alright, that's that's fair. <laughs> aye, aye, aye. Okay, I think I have to go down here and around. Because the telegraph's in a hidden spot. So for those who weren't watching before... Oh my god. Alright, I can't go off the jump there. That sucks. Uh, my father, who's now dead, was a, uh, a general in the, uh, German army. We are in Italy. He is German. Our mother was Italian. Yeah, here it is right here. No? Right here. Yeah. This thing with this puzzle is actually pretty cool. It took me a minute to kind of figure it out the last time, but I think I got it now. Ho messo la foto dove richiesto. Devo trovare le parole giuste per comunicarlo. E devo ricordarmi la The code word is um the village is on fire. <clears throat> or town on fire? Yeah, town on fire. Town on fire. Select the words you need to create a message. What's the fucking message I need to send? I don't remember. Uh. But a photo left or something? I don't know. <laughs> 
I don't remember. Riding that bike is a major pain. Experience general discomfort. This character has a lot of private problems. They're probably someone killed since most allies would take generals alive. Ah, uh, but the uh, the Germans killed him though. Uh, you need to find the kernel of truth in the store. God damn it. What the hell? Uh, let's do... Photo... Um... Photo... Located... House... Beside... River. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It has to be seven words, I'm pretty sure, too. You need to find a D. Okay, so now we gotta do send. I'll add over the end to make it clear that I finished. I keep forgetting to fucking do that. Um, where's over, 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 over. Okay. Oh, Germans killed the German. Uh, German. No reason why they lost the war. Well, the war's not over yet. Non mi sembra chiaro. What? Vogliono le parole giuste. The foot of the map has been positioned. Okay, fine. Photo... Map. Map, 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 map. Photo map. I don't think this has been on here. It's probably positioned. Yeah. And then over, send. There we go. This takes a lot of concentration to make sure I fuck it up. See if we get a response back. All right. So then we, so now we have the Morse code coming in, and we need to use the bottom part. We have to follow the dots or dashes to get to the correct letter. Figure out which um, letters they are that fit the words. So the first one um, is a dash dot dash dot. So it's C. And then dot dash is A, so C A dot dash dot is R, so car dash dash carm, C A R M, tank. <clears throat> okay. Uh, dot dash dot dot is L dash dot dash dot C L C dot dash dot dot LCL LCL yep lo tank located and then uh, dash dot dash just K over it worked out the position of the tank I should confirm that I the message with received so I should do received over and out Oh, okay, no, we want them to receive our reception. <laughs> God damn it. This is like TCP packets. Terrible. Jesus, we're getting three words? Four words? Bro, I got things to do. You're, we're getting bombed out here, and I'm trying to be a spy for you. These are Italian spies, by the way, that don't that are not cool with the Nazis taking over in Italy, which I think would be yeah, a problem. Uh, so this is... That's just a dash. So that's T... Dot dash dot R T R dot 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 dash V T U V 
Uh, maybe not. T R. Yeah, what the fuck? T. Hmm. R. Hmm. Hmm. T R V. I'm pretty sure that's T R V. Oh, it's right there. I can't. I couldn't see it. Um. No. I, so I'm helping. Um. The Italian resistance. Um. They are. I. So our our. The boyfriend in game who's dead. We found a letter on him that said to call this number, and they're telling us to use the telegraph and stuff. Dot dash is A. Dot. Dash dot is R. Dash dash M. A R M. Arm. Weapons. Find weapons. Oh boy. Dash dot dot D. Dot dash dash dot DP. Dot dot dot. DPS. T. DPST. Cash. Okay. Uh, dot 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 dash is V dash dot dash dot is C V C dash dot N V C N near dash dot 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 is B dot 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 is S B S boom 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 B S C Woods Woods, there we go. And then dash dot dash is K, which is over. There's a weapon cache in the woods. In my woods? Okay, I'll search for it. Let's respond to received again. <clears throat> received. Over. Send. Alright, I'm going to get another response, I'm assuming. Hopefully it's over and out. Uh, we're getting something else back. Two words, three words. Oh my god. What else do you want me to fucking do? I have to go into town at some point. We're gonna get seven words again. Okay. Dot, dash, dash, dot is P. I wish I could click the letter to, like, put it in place. That'd be nice. P, dash, dash, dot, dot, Z, dash, dash, dot, dot, Z, P, Z, Z. P, Z, place. Ah! Yo, Creepy Pastero, what's up? Glad to hear you have internet back. Thanks for coming and hanging out. We're just playing some uh, Martha is Dead, and I'm doing Morse code. <laughs> Which doesn't seem like the right thing at all. B N D B N D Place flag dot dash dash dot is P dot dash dot dot is L P L Pole Place flag pole Be sure to drink your oval team Morse code. I don't know if, but how's it going? Uh, I don't really know it either, but this seems to be working pretty well. Um, I'm doing well. It's Sunday night. We're trying to finish up Martha is Dead, and then we're going to start up um, Madison. Uh, I've heard a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot about it, so I figured I'd get it. Um, Fry, if you're still here, could you give a shout out to Creepy Pistero? That'd be fantastic. Meanwhile, I'm going to try to figure out where to place this flagpole. I better say my ass. <laughs> dot dash dot dot L. Dash dot dash dot LC light. Ooh, Resident Evil 4. <laughs> Explode, damn it! <laughs> oh god, do it! Do it! No. <laughs> damn. Wi Fi's back. Doing spoopy and chill games soon. Oh god, that clip was pretty funny. Um. <laughs> so we have place flag pole light dash dot dash dot c dot dash dot dot c l dash 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 o c l o close um 
dash dot dash dot c dash dash m dash so cm cmm communications uh dot dash is a and dot dash dot is r air over and out okay so after i've been there i'll place a flag on the telephone pole near the house they will then know that i have accomplished the task easy peasy i didn't say received on that one okay let's see so now find the weapons cache which is way the fuck out there okay we can head that way though we're not too far so just stay to the left the whole way got it that is uh, good to go excuse me hello yo getting on this bike is a puzzle what is this there we go. My god. That game was going to so slow due to my CPU, but I'm doing that game soon again on my PS2. Oh, nice. You may want to... Um, <coughs> well, I don't have to wait, but... Um, rumor has it that... They killed my cow. Fuckers. You're welcome. Absolutely. Anytime. Thank you for coming in. Um... So there is, uh, rumors. Are you fucking serious, kid? Oh, my God. Fine. Um. Alright, what's going on here? Why can I not go there? I can't go on foot, and I can't take the bike. How, pray tell, do I get there? Is there another way to get there? No. <laughs> there is none. What the fuck? That is bullshit. I don't want to fucking go into town. And the, the bicycle. Why do I have to go all the way down to the... Crawl. <laughs> Honestly, at this rate, not a bad idea. So the puppeteers go to San Cassianos to hang out with Don. Water can or where the hell that is. Why is the bicycle telling me to go there? Strange. But for some reason, I can't get there. I guess I have to go into town. Like... I don't have another option. Maybe I maybe I come back. Maybe this isn't the end. Or maybe it's not the end game, I should say. So alright, we'll go into town. Fuck it. Come on, kid. Fucking pop a wheelie or something. God fucking damn it. Do I have to go all the way around here? I do. Oh, that's so obnoxious. Thanks for the luck, Demon. Appreciate you, pal. Um, hmm. Well, this is unfortunate. <laughs> Awkward. It's a bike. Do a trick. I Seriously, I was saying I was going to do a fucking tail whip earlier. Yo, Queen Kitty, what's up? Thank you for the, uh, the channel points of the behind-the-scenes stream. Seems like a lot of people are intrigued by the idea. I am fucking stuck. Bro. Julia. Have you ever learned how to ride a fucking bike before this evening? If you didn't know your city is being bombed, it's time to get going and learn how to do this shit. Okay. They were good to go now. So we're gonna go to town. So up at the intersection coming up here, I have to take a right I'm pretty sure of. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> that fucking emote's hysterical. <laughs> uh Fry, can you give Queen Kitty a shout out as well? Uh Queen Kitty uh was asking to follow some new horror streamers, and one speed was kind enough to throw my name into the hat. Uh why? I don't know. He thinks I'm good. Oh, here we go. We made it to the town or something. Hey kids, because at this point 
I just might die. A whole bunch. Who's Ooh, RE2 reboot. Fuck today? yeah. It's probably going to be me. I think that's why I'm going to. <laughs> the following chapter contains a scene displaying self harm. Some players may find the scene disturbing. Would you like to view the censored version? Um. Honestly, at this point, what we had to deal with the fucking dog was was really rough. What, I, what does everyone think? Tell me in chat. Do you want to see censored version or uncensored version? Be honest. It's okay. Because uh, seeing the... It wasn't actual harm of a dog. It was a repressed memory being shown via a uh, couple marionettes that they basically... Oh, it was rough. Oh, yeah. Um... And, and not to not to I was not trying to spoil the game for anyone that didn't see it, but it's essentially the um, the the mother, without giving details, kills the dog, and then does further things with the dog. Um, it is it is not good. Uh, but this this scene though, I don't know what this is. This is a self harm thing. Um, it doesn't mention the term suicide. Which I, if I saw that, I'd say I'd like the suit, uh, the censored version. Like, yeah, I, I think I think we'll do the censored version because I'm pretty sure Twitch would say no to that. Normally, I'm someone that's like, ah, no, fuck censorship. But like, I think there's limits with everything. Plus, like, I don't want to get yelled at by Twitch or if this goes on YouTube later. So let's stick with censored version. If you think that's a bullshit call, make fun of me in the chat. I won't Wait, rag on you. But I'll laugh for sure. They avevano uccisi tutti ed era colpa mia. Avevano la mia età. Alcuni erano nostri amici. The the dog scene was terrible. Non yes. Pensavo che sarebbe andata così. Oh, the rumor. I'm sorry. Cosa mi aspettavo? Mi uh, Resident Evil 4 is gonna get a reboot, Avevo similar to the first three. Mio padre. Era mio padre e lo amavo. Lapo era mio amico e lo amavo. Da che parte stavo? Io ascoltavo solo il mio cuore. Pensavo fosse giusto. E invece era la cosa peggiore da fare. Ok. Is there a map here? No? Can't do anything here in the bag? Uh. I don't want to talk to them. Ok, good. Oh, it has been confirmed. I it's the last time I heard it was still a rumor. It was. Varcata quella soglia persi definitivamente. Once they crossed that threshold, they completely lost touch with reality. Um. Yeah, when around me had died while I survived everything. Oh my God. I'm a marionette. This is a marionette. Na, 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 na. Heard about it even comes out like four days before my B day in March next year. Oh, that's sick. This, however, is not. Pay no attention to the man behind the curtain. What the fuck? Oh god. The oh god, the door's gone. Oh, oh my. My eyes! The raven. I can't sprint either. And we get Ave Maria playing in the background. Yo, this is fucked. This isn't even the self-harm part. It's already fucked. Faceva delle domande, ma io non capivo cosa mi stessi chiedendo. Oh. Scrisse qualcosa su un foglio. Due infermiere mi portarono via. Yeah. Ero in un manicomio. Yeah, I was going to say, they must have figured out where, what happened. Altre and they were waiting for me. Altre che si cospargevano con i propri escrementi. Poi c'erano quelle violente. Quelle che cercavano di farsi male in tutti i modi. C'era una giovane donna che si masturbava tutto il giorno, ininterrottamente. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Incessantly to the point where she would bleed? Oh, my God. 
bestemmiava e delirava per giorni finché le ferite non morivano si legava riprendeva la sua she was untouched she would just start again oh god quella donna ero io that woman was me cominciarono a farmi delle iniezioni scuotevano tutto il corpo injections while they gave they gave me my whole body shake I broke my vertebrae and an ankle it was called cardiazol or something like that Ero come un fuoco che non si vuole spegnere. My body was like a fire that didn't want to be put out. What the fuck? Is this passion of the Christ? No. <laughs> it was worse. But it appeared to be quenched. She would come back even stronger than before. In the end, though, they won. I stopped screaming and masturbating. And I stopped thinking. There's no longer any need for therapy. Something inside of me had died. But nevertheless, I insisted on carrying along this painful journey. I was stronger than I ever could have imagined. What the fuck? So I never got to go to the weapons cache. That sucks. Like, I never had a chance to actually go over there. Um, to drop the photograph off because everything's skyrocketed. anybody that. else. When I think about you, I touch myself. God though. damn it. I don't want anybody else. When I think about you, I touch myself. <sighs> this is going to be a mirror. It's not going to be who we think we are. Oh god, it's worse. We're a marionette now. We're a puppet. With nipples? That's a little aggressive. Chi sei? Aspetta. Aspetta. Until you bleed. Risposte. Non andare via. Parlami di Marta, ti prego. Martha is dead. Marta è morta. L'ho uccisa per impossessarmi della sua vita. Non troverò mai pace per quello che ho fatto. Temevo che fosse così. I fear that would be the case. What about mommy? I killed her too. <laughs> La mamma è morta. Nessuno lo sa meglio di me purtroppo. Inutile cercare di illudere. Oh, we didn't get flashbang, but just it's very bright. I do what I think I've done. Sì, yes. maledizione. È successo veramente. L'ho fatta a pezzi e l'ho seppellita sotto il pieces and buried her under the bridge. God, all that blood. My God, I knew it. What about Daddy? The soldiers, did that really happen? I think so. Felt real. I got shot by soldiers before. I'm going to say I don't know. If I think back to the moment, everything is muddled. I don't know how to answer. No answer is perhaps the most painful answer. What about Nanny? She got bombed. She is dead. <laughs> Nothing to do with it. <clears throat> yeah, uh, this is the end of the story. And this is just like wrapping stuff up. Everything before this was fucked. I mean, this is still fucked, but everything before this was fucked. Ho paura a chiedere di là. I'm afraid to ask about Lapo. Well. He is dead. È esploso su una mina. Amico di una vita. Si era messo nei guai e ha pagato. He got in trouble and paid with his life. One last question. The pregnancy? It was Martha's. Martha was pregnant. Martha era incinta. Il suo bimbo deforme Her deformed baby died with her. Yeah, we fucking dug it out of her. <laughs> yeah, I think this is the, I think this is wrapping up. It's all inside of us. Yeah, yeah. We just need to turn the mirror. It is not all just the reflection of a noble existence, nothing more than a puppet show. What in the fuck? Alright, I'll just flip it then. See you later. Nice knowing you. Uh myself. Um 
I look worse. Ready for everything with open arms, even ready to kill? Oh, God. Legs are always ready to run. So I'm assuming this was the self-harm. We just didn't have to watch her basically breaking herself. Which still, like, it's it's not a human. It's a mannequin. But still, it's pretty... It's, it's fucked up. Oh, God. The womb that conceived in sin. Yeah, adultery is sin, isn't it? Even though they're not really married, I think it's looks at adultery at the time. <laughs> Lastly, the mind. Oh my god. To protect it has turned us into monsters. Either way, we cannot live like this, can we? I'll take care of it. I don't need to worry. I'll try to sleep if I can. Uh, if it is, no, ju no judgment for me. I've got this. Oh, the fuck! So that's our mind taking control. It's not like a split personality, but it's like that that part of the brain that just kind of creates different things. Oh, God. Oh. Oh, yeah, okay. I see. Okay, that's a good censored version, because I don't like that shit at all. Oh, man. Il 26 luglio Sant'Assano fu bombardata e la chiesa fu distrutta. Ma io non ero lì allora. Ero già in manicomio. Ancora una volta, testardamente, non ero morta. Le bombe non mi avevano uccisa ed ero sopravvissuta anche a me stessa. La prova più assurda, quella più dura. Ma la guerra ora è finita da tempo. Là fuori e soprattutto dentro di me. Ero dalla parte sbagliata del cancello. Ma ora posso voltare pagina. La vita sta aprendo di nuovo le sue porte, non è vero? Se non fossi stata così fortunata da sopravvivere a me stessa, avrei buttato via tutto. You kind of did throw everything away. Pensiamo che i pericoli siano attorno a noi, pronti ad aggredirci. Ma quelli più subdoli e ingannevoli sono dentro di noi. Crescono senza che ce ne rendiamo conto. Ci fanno soffrire e ci spingono a perdere il senso e il rispetto di noi stessi. Avrei voluto chiedere aiuto, ma ero sola. Questa è la mia storia. Grazie per essere qui, di avermi ascoltato. Ora sono pronta per andare. Quanto ci vorrà per arrivare a casa? Just leaving the asylum and going back home? New skin unlocked on the camera. Hey, that's cool. Achievement unlocked death. Force to say it is possible to ask for help and receive it if we are alone, if we are desperate, if it feels like life doesn't make sense. If it feels like there's nothing left for us, it's only because we can no longer see it. There's always something to live for. Something great could be just around the corner. You literally threw your mother away. Yes. Good words there on the screen. If you or someone you know is struggling, information and crisis resources are available at safeinourworld.org slash find-help. Um, they, they popped it up at the beginning of the game as well. Holy fuck. That game was some deep shit. Um, it was definitely more of a thriller than it would be a horror game if there's a difference there. I know there is, but more psychological. Very, very psychological. That was an ending, yes. Um, I have a feeling we could have got a different ending if... I was able to get that last job done. Um, I'm just looking at the... Well, I was going to look at the... Um, uh, achievements, but they're not there. 
Are there no achievements in this game? Huh. Alright, I'm gonna skip the credits. Oh, it's fast forward. Okay. Yo, Doc, what up? Uh, yeah, that game, the game was pretty wild, man. Oh, you said weird. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it, it's weird, it's wild, like... The story was very good. I was definitely bouncing back and forth between who I thought killed Martha. Um, but yeah, that was... Martha's in, Martha's in. Oh, I thought that was going to say Martha's Ed's coming back. I'm like, what? I'm like, how did you make a sequel on that? My theory was that she was actually Martha and that her mind made her think she was Julia to protect herself. Maybe it could be true, but doesn't quite add up. I mean, you were kind of close there. The, the mind made up a lot of shit, for sure. And that's it. So there's nothing else there. Um, okay. Fantastic. Music? Thank you. All right. Uh, yo, Doc, I'm doing well, man. I'm doing well. Uh, we just completed Martha is Dead. Uh, very interesting game, for sure. Um, I, I will say, if you're if you haven't played that one, uh, be wary. There is some. Uh, uh, how should I say this? Just we'll just say dog abuse. It's the best thing I can really say. The animal abuse, specifically about a dog. Um, I really want to see if there was. Um, there, so there were achievements. I was gonna say there's definitely achievements. I missed eight of them. So I got all diary pages read, every newspaper edition read, observed an in-house object, taken the first photo, developed the first photo, dressed in Martha's clothes, played the first puppet theater sequence, entered the family crypt. Oh, we never did the uh, flowers. <clears throat> played the second puppet theater sequence, communicated with the white lady. That was fucked. The white lady was fucking scary. Collected all camera accessories, carried out a divination every day, completed the game story. We missed taking all IR photos with hidden riddles. We missed that. Taking all four IR photos of the lady. Taking a photo with every camera accessory. Completed Lapo's quest we didn't get to finish. Completed all telephone calls for obtaining information. We literally could not call the last place. Uh, discovered the house in the woods. Oh. Oh, that's probably where the cache was. I couldn't get out there. Fixed the bike and never found the pump for it. Taking five photos with no story link. Oh, I guess I did like two of them technically. And then developed ten photos with no story link. Huh. That's certainly content. <laughs> yeah. I, yeah, yeah. We'll, uh, we'll leave it at that. Um, I'm gonna go sell some beef pics. I'll see all of you lovely people later. <laughs> Knox, buddy old pal, I just hope you kept your feet nice and grimy. Cause that gets the most content out of all of all. For realsies. <laughs> Fucked. Thanks for dropping in, buddy. Take it easy. If anyone hasn't followed Noxler yet, please go and do so. Uh, fellow horror streamer. Um, also plays Escape from Tarkov if you're into FPS games. Uh, specifically hardcore ones that break your soul. <laughs> uh, I'm just setting us up now with our sounds. Feet picks are calling you. Alrighty, we're going to move on with Madison. Whether you want me to or not. Uh, Madison. We have updated the stream info successfully. Um, let's go here. So how is everyone else doing on this lovely Sunday evening? Any good plans for um, this upcoming week? Weekend. Okay, good. That's now popping up there. Great. All right. And I think we're good to start. I'll hop on over here. Uh, music. Be quiet. Thank you. Okay. 
Staying up over 24 hours to mod a stream Saturday into today is catching up to me. Oh, Jesus, Twy. <laughs> God. All right. Press any button to start. Uh, let me go through the basics here, because I just literally bought this earlier today. Turn sound mode on or off. When sound mode is active, the main character will be muted, but the subtitles will remain visible. Interesting. I'll leave it. I'll leave it on though. I like to hear the voice acting. Part of the immersion. Uh, mouse and keyboard. Watch us walk around. Look. Interact and take photos and shake photos. And left click. Shift is run. Hold right click to use instant camera. Zoom into photos with the wheel. Tab is inventory. Space is read. Back is right click. Perfect. No complaints for me on that one. Language English. Voice English subtitles are on. Fantastic. Video. Um. I'm gonna dumb it down to high. I guess you really can't tell the difference there in the resolution, can you? I guess you kinda can. Uh, reflections, medium is good. Volumetric lighting, keep that to low. Go switch word again and maybe have a pain on my stream coming soon. Good, glad to hear it, bud. Uh, my buddy was doing a 24 hour stream and I wanted to support him and end up there the whole time. <laughs> That's awesome, though. Okay. Extras, we got nothing, obviously. We just started. Story. New game. Uh, recommended visual hints. Okay, so it's recommended. We have visual hints, photography zones, normal enemies, infinite instant photos, and autosave. Hard mode is hearted, non-guided experiences. No visual hints, no photography zones, Harder enemies, infinite instant photos, and autosave. At least it's still autosave. If this was something like Resident Evil, you have to have, like, the, uh, the ink ribbons. Ooh. Yes. There was no V-Sync selection, believe it or not. Let's do normal for now. Um, and then maybe we'll come back and do hard another time. Luca. Remember that you can mute the main character. I don't care. I don't care. I want to listen. I feel like it adds so much into the, uh... That's what I do carry is use a safe to store items you don't need. Oh, this is taking a while to load, I just realized. Do, 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 do. Okay, bloodiest games. This is gonna be good. I have a good feeling about this game. My expectations are reasonably high. Oh, oh my god, my head. God. Well, what happened? Hello? Oh, it looks pretty good on your side, actually, over there. Show me that. Just answer me that! Answer you what? Family. I don't... Your own blood. What? What the hell were you thinking? What in the hell crossed your mind? Luca? What the fuck is happening to you? Five, six, seven? You've ruined our family. What am I gonna do now? Sunbox. What am I gonna do? Bro, I don't know who the fuck you are. Is there anything else in here? I don't think there is. Let me go check up here anyways. Oh great, that means the doors are going to be click and drag too. Hello? From your cousin? Cousin Romeo, 626. Buenos Aires, Argentina. Oh. This is the Macklemore Street. I can't take that? Like, okay. Cool. I have to find the handle. Okay. Got it. Oh, that door's locked anyways, huh? Okay. I'll just uh, escape through here then. 
Can't use a sunbox on that. Okay. There's gotta be some type of item ah! here. Yo, Twisted, what up? Welcome in, welcome in. How you doing, pal? I don't understand. I can't. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, no. this, this can't be happening. God. Holy shit. Okay. So that's what the interact button was for. Holy fuck. Enjoying the weekend? Glad to hear it, my dude. Glad to hear it indeed. Alright, that white dot's always on the screen. This isn't like Tarkov, where if there's an, you're looking at an item, it's like, oh, hey. Oh! Sick. Alright, now what's over here at the couch? Oh, I have to move it? Hello? is difficult. Oh, it's the doorknob. Um, oh, for this thing probably, huh? Yeah. It's all this. Oh, a hammer. Okay, we can rotate it back now. So I can actually see. See, I mean, we just started uh, Madison. Everyone's, I, I, everyone was telling me I should play this game. Yeah, this has a lot of like visage feel to it already. You are not my son. You are not my son. Oh, okay. I'll leave then. I can't open it, like, at all. Oh, I see. Come on. Maybe I can get up to Grandpa's house. Oh, fuck. I, I gotta get out of here. Going around with a oh, oh, jeez. Candy, thank you for the host. That scared the shit out of me. Huh. Hello? Holy lux! Use the hammer. <laughs> shit. That's a lot of lux. <clears throat> Candy, how you doing, my friend? I need to find a way out. Thank you again for the hose. Before Dad notices I'm here. I'm sorry, where did you come from? I feel like I just fucking jumped at that. Yo, Alice, what's up? I am playing Madison, yes. <laughs> I, everyone kind of uh, made it sound really good, so my expectations were th through the fucking roof. And uh, I'd actually won a $10 Steam gift card from Twilight Soul, who's in the chat here. Uh, maybe falling asleep at the moment, we don't know, but... Grandpa was just like Dad. Grandpa? That's distorted. Wait, can I rotate it? Like the other way? Albert Marwell, 1968. Be better than butt cheeks, Jugs, please. Oh, is he having a hard time playing this? Oh, look at these pictures of candles and cockroaches. My, Delicious. My birthday present? 16. How did I get here? Interact. Hey! My camera. What? 
don't get it. Do I take another one, like right here? Looks like people hunched over. Obsessed with this game? Oh, good. You know, it's, <laughs> it's all love. Yes. And the chair changed direction. That was interesting. Um. Oh, well, those can't be it. Negative one. Oh, scroll it. Okay. Oh. 1968, they said? 19... Minus one? No? Maybe it was 1968. I don't like the open doorway thing. I'm like just not paying attention to it at all. Do I take a picture of it? You know, Boris, I had to cancel the stream settings. Twitch, <laughs> Twitch app being shit. Yeah, the Twitch app is not good. That is for sure. Okay, there's nothing crazy there. So, maybe there's something else that I need to find. Top one's locked, bottom one is... What's that? Uh, an I? Study. Oh. Oh, it's an inventory. It must be broken. Got it. So I figured it would be 1968 because this photo, 1968. This will go back. Um, why are there no lights on all of a sudden here? Fuck. Oh god, that clock's back. Wasn't there a door here? I don't think so. Oh shit! Motherfucker. Okay, let's do that. It's not for the study key. Two holes or something. And then you probably have to do a certain time. Anything down here? No. Shit. I bet you take a picture of the other thing. Yeah, nothing different there in the image. The fuck was that? Say ten shipping. Ten. Alright, let's do it. Shake, shake, shake. Oh man, I have an absolute blast, homie. Can't watch too much and say I gotta play the rest for sure. Thank you so much for dropping it, man. Thank you for the biddies. Thanks for being awesome. Um, we'll be in touch. We gotta we gotta get a, uh, some co-op stuff together soon. What does that say? Oh, it's the label number at the top. All right, so I didn't do anything. Uh, maybe I need to use the camera when there's no lights on.
Alright, that one had no lights on and it didn't want to work. Yeah. Maybe it has to be both lights I need to do it for. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I'm like, what the hell is going on? Twister, thank you for the host. I have no idea if I even got that at the right timing. No. Uh, maybe that's not what I have to do then. Maybe I have to use it down here so I can see what the fuck's down here. Even though I know it's there. Fuck. Oh, but she thinks of the host, man. Hey, look what it is. <laughs> Dude, this. I specifically didn't look. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, but you have to take a picture of where the door used to be. That didn't work. There used to be a picture here. <clears throat> that was nothing. Okay. I mean, I get the picture thing. <clears throat> Maybe I do have to use... Fuck. You have to do it with both lights. Wait till both lights come on. I think I got it. Still really not doing anything here. Hmm. Do I take a picture of the blanket? that I can tell. Huh. Hello? Um, I may want one in a bit. I'll make sure I have all the mechanics down in the game, too. Fuck, this isn't cool. These lights are on, and there's also mixing picture frames here, too. Hmm. Let's try it. Uh, nothing really there. Shit. The random little noises of things like getting knocked over and shit. Like that. There's nothing down here I can touch. Shit. Um, Alice, was I on the right path with all of the lights? Like, do I have to take a picture when all the lights go out or when all the lights go... What the fuck is that? Why didn't I ever notice this before? Oh! What the fuck is all this? There's some weird shit on the walls over there, far left. 
serial writer? What the fuck is this room? The instant camera. Until now, which is now in my hands, apparently. Oh. And now for the weather. Fuck. Well, shit. That was nifty. I'm assuming that just will continue to talk to me occasionally. Now I'm scared something's changed. helpful uh, excuse me uh, it's got to be something else that I've missed I'm sorry, you what oh oh it doesn't go there yes it's another oh, oh the right here it goes I bet I should find a nail or something to hang it with Okay. Oh, fuck me. This goddamn camera. I'll tell you, buddy. Hiya! Yeah. Yeah. Gotcha. Oh, I called it a camera. That's a clock. I'm dumb. Alright, let's get this over with. What time is it? Tell me what time it is. What is that? Eh! A fucking nail. Oh, well, thank you for the assistance. Nail. I saw that too. Jesus fuck. Hi, tree. All right. Let's uh, use a rusted nail, the hammer, knocks it in, and then we can put the por uh, the portrait up here, of the creepy old man with his camera. I'm a bad, I'm a bad motherfucker in the world. Oh, Alice, thank you so much for the sub. So kind of you. Did someone happen to look at the counter beforehand? I don't remember what it was at. I want to make sure it works. It's been causing problems recently. So I finished this thing? It doesn't even give me... Holy fucker. It doesn't give me an item to use at the Cuckoo Clock of Doom over here. Whatever. Let's go check out this other room. See if I can... Anything new in here? Is this TV going to go off again? Go crazy in there? No? I heard something in here. No, nothing new. Okay. <clears throat> oh my goodness. Alright. Let me go talk to the clock again. Maybe there's something I can do with it. No. I can't. Can we stop moving stuff around here? I'm closing this door. I just don't want to even deal with looking down the hallway anymore. Even though it's a fucking dead end. Okay. So what else can I possibly do here? 
What else I can really pick up? Maybe I can take a picture of the guy holding the camera. That'd be pretty funny. Oh, shit! Alright. I think that worked. Wait, is he pointing at me? He's pointing at me in that picture. Bro. Whoa! Okay. And the clock's gone. Study key? Yep. Okay, so this is the study. Oh, this is the room. Okay. Oh. Oh, boy. What the hell has Dad been doing here? Set a well in her basement. Oh my god. There's pictures that have been bought. Oh god. The Church of Horrors. What does all that say? Oh my. It doesn't make sense. So apparently our dad was trying to figure out what all this was. Like what happened? I guess he was—he wasn't convinced that it was just mental illness. He thinks something actually happened. That's locked. Okay. I just wanted to make sure I didn't miss any other objects. What's this? Matches. Oh, it's a key. J. All right, we have a J key. Alright, well this TV sucks. Jesus. Fuck, I could not like the random noises. Fuck was that noise? Oh, this is the safe I think they were talking about. Acoustic cassette, number one. Okay, I don't have, I don't have a cassette player. The sub counter did work. It started zero and after it ticked to one. Oh, thank you. It's been super finicky for some reason. Um, so I appreciate Please that capture. Thomas. All right, let me just read this like this. John, I hope you found this useful. Please be careful. Remember what we talked about. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Priest Thomas. I know tapes are old, but I still struggle with computers. Nothing in there, okay. The J key apparently unlocks the safe. Uh, I guess I could store the sun box because there's nothing else in there that I, there's just pictures of what the fuck happened to Achieve and unlock the extra pockets. Cool. Um, I'll put all the photos away, I guess. I don't need to... I should keep this. Fine! I guess I'll keep everything for now. I don't have anything else. I could... Four out of eight. What can I take? Luca's notebook? What's that? My notebook? So Dad's the one who took it away from me. All right, let's go check out the, the notebook here. I don't Sister's leg. Any of these? Am I going Mom's insane? Mom's arm. Dad's head. Oh boy. All right, I guess I'll put that back. No point in holding on to it. I better hold on to this. Fine. Um, I will store in its place the cassette. 
because I haven't found a cassette player yet. And when I find one, I can just come back here and grab it. Okay. I feel like I'm gonna Grandpa's run into my house. Oh, this is Grandpa's house, okay. I haven't been here since he died. So your house is connected to Grandpa's house. And no one's cleaned up and tried selling the place? I mean, how long ago did he die? I mean, it's kind of an aggressive question to ask, but... I'm just curious. Oh, son of a bitch! Fuck. This storm must have taken up the power. I think Grandpa had a generator in the basement. Oh, fuck off. This is the TV, which means over here is my cassette. Okay. <sighs> this is off to a fucking great start. All the way across the other door. Because this thing's gonna run on batteries, not electricity. No? Are you serious? I'm apparently gonna just follow the red light, because, you know, that's how games get you. Grandma and Grandpa's room. I almost closed it. It's dark. Can't see shit. I hate statues, like just the religious statues, just ha they creep me out. Damn, look at this fucking generator. Uh. Lights, motherfuckers. Alright, let's head back. Let's clear out the kitchen before we come down this hallway again. Uh, very creepy. Agreed. Now I can apparently listen to the tape. From the moment of first contact... It is already too late. When a demon what? attaches itself to a human... Demons? It becomes a parasite of sorts. It feeds from the host until it devours every last part of their soul. In most instances, the demon's relentless objective is to get back to the world of the living. If you what want to break that about? link... Well, I'm afraid it's no simple matter. I could speak at length about various rituals and procedures, but by far the best way is to obey. Help what? the demon attain that which it seeks. Only then will the demon leave of its own accord. Usually they enter the earthly plane through certain objects that they use as conduits between worlds like a cuckoo clock Even or if you or the, or the clock that maybe? object later the demon has made the contact it needs and already walks among us in the first stages of possession the host human tends to withdraw from friends and family becoming aggressive so even violent 
This is the I'm result possessed. of the spiritual battle between the host and the entity. Maybe, maybe it's both maybe dad's the one that's for possessed, control huh? over the mortal body. The symptoms that indicate that the possession is progressing are dizziness, nausea, and headaches. The latter of which can be so intense as to render the host unconscious for days. The dark entity manipulates its host with visual hallucinations and voices in the mind. Oh boy. Destroying the sanity of the host is for the purpose of making them I can't malleable, contacted compliant. This and this is how the demon fully exerts its insidious control. Oh, and before I forget, several cases of possession saw strange behavioral yeah, patterns in nearby yeah. insects. You Cockroaches in particular. Horror film inside. I advise Ooh. You not the reason. Steer clear of the insects. Talk about it. Oh. Well, thank you very much for the biddies. You could have just told me that without There's that, but thank you. There's just no way. I um, can't. And yeah, that movie is fucked. <laughs> there must be a mistake. Those pictures, that leg, that arm, I didn't do it. So hi, Wheeler. Dad Welcome thinks in. it was me, but I... Um, I <laughs> Fry, if you're still here, can you give Wheeler a shout out? My head. Oh, he's got headaches. A, a door. A red door. Uh, What's happening to me? Is this what that man was talking? I mean, this about? is how the game started. It can't be happening. Sick to fuck me. movie, indeed. Yeah. It was pretty hard to watch. Yeah, that's fair. Could it be the basement door? Maybe. First off, I completely forgot. Um, I think Fry was going to take out, take off for a bit. So I'm going to give Wheeler a quick shouty. If you guys haven't followed Wheeler yet, now is the time. Yes, rematch. <laughs> I figured. <laughs> oh, oh, he's on, on the other team, team again. Yeah, yeah. Oh, he's getting destroyed. <laughs> Good old Rocket League. <laughs> um, yeah, so uh, for those of you who don't know Wheeler Dealer, he raised uh, all the uh, proceeds from the uh, from his streams go to charity for the doggos. Need I say more? We blew that kid up. <laughs> Another cuckoo clock? Can't even do anything with those yet. Huh. I think this is a really fucked up episode of Hoarders. For Grandpa. It's so nice having both houses connected. Luca. We were able to have breakfast. Chanel. Grandpa. Every Grandpa. Morning. Excited to see Martyrs down to continue the French. Oh my god, dude. Martyrs is so fucked. Like, you think inside was fucked? Just wait. Just you fucking wait. Insects. Oh, it's not really different behavioral. Just stupid. What's that? Ooh! Some type of trying. Oh, for the door! Oops. Nothing there. Lots of bleach in this house. Oh. Well, that's important, obviously. Nothing up there. Nothing up there but coffee mugs. Okay. I used to watch the sorts of fucked up movies like this, but as I get older, I have less of a taste for it. It's almost Eli Roth torture porn, but not quite. Um. It's not hostile. Uh, neither of them are really hostile. They're just they're just gory horror films. Another hole in the wall. I don't like that. Yeah, I can't see through that at all. Oh, we're over here. 
because the basement's over that way. All right, well, I guess we'll hang out with uh, the weird statue. Why do I feel like it changed the way it was looking? Oh, look, hello, kitties. Lots of pills. Ooh, what's this? Grandpa dedicated his whole life to clock making. Clock making, huh? Stopped at nine o'clock and uh, seven, eight seconds. Grow without feeling nasty. That's fair. Ah, right, thank you for the lurk, buddy. Thank you so much. All right, let's turn the TV on. I don't really know what the point of that was. But here we are. So I'll check these rooms out. Maybe it unlocks at 9.15. Here's a nice bathroom with a Ugh, shut... That smells awful. The pipes must be clogged. Do not use... Chains? Maybe I can break them with something. Break these cuffs. Up with the red. Oh, it's a collectible. Interesting. Just legit a red picture. Okay, that's fair. All right, so this goes to the other side. Yep. And then this is locked. This is Grandma and Grandpa's room. Blue knees. Is real? Blue knees. I'll take a picture of it and see what happens. Probably nothing. You already hit one thing in the room, right? Nope. Alright, let's go and uh Can I do anything with the statue? Is there something on the plate? No can't light the candles or anything. I'll check this door. I gotta find a way to open this door if I want to get out of this house. Alright, stop crying about it. Alright, how about this? Let's backtrack a ways because I have a triangle key. I want to go and use it. So that way it's one less thing that I'm carrying because your inventory is eight items maximum. So I just go ahead and use this. That would be good. Nice. So now the next one is, oh, it's another triangle. And apparently they do two at a time. So if there's only one more key. <laughs> Cakewalk. All right, so now we gotta go down to the red door, apparently. Why oh, should really? Dad said he was repairing Grandpa's house, but instead he's been investigating this woman. What is going on? <clears throat> God damn! All right. Oh no! Nope. Uh, actually, what do I have on me here? I have to keep the book, hammer, photo. Yeah, this. Least amount of shit I can have, so four out of eight. Okay. Let's go ahead to the basement. Because I think it's our best option at this moment. Because everything else we've kind of cleared up. There is no need to cut off the power right now. Oh, no, I agree. I just saw the eyeball there, and I wanted to figure out what was going on. What's over here? Are those planets? <sighs> Look like planets. Like Jupiter and maybe Mars? Oh yeah, look at that! Jupiter and Mars! Hey hey! Oh god. This should be good.
Can I get a fucking flashlight, please? Oh, fuck. Bunch of bags of trash in her blocks and Clorox. The red door. It's locked. I'll take a picture of all the bugs climbing all over it, I guess. Right? That did it. Yo, what the fuck? Ha <laughs> ha. So this is where it happened. What? What is this it's place? It's the well. So there's the main this menu is here. Impossible. What's what's wrong with me? A spade? Let's go. I definitely just heard something fair like whispering or something. Uh. Ringu, is that you? Ha! I see what you did there. Those symbols. Oh, that was on, I've uh... seen them before. Yeah, they're on the wall in the study. What do I do? <sighs> I find I'm gonna go out for brunch. Oh, nice! Well, enjoy your brunch. Thank you very much for the, the lark ski. Very, very nice of you. Oh, I see. So there's two different symbols I have to use here. It looks like a crime scene. Does it? Oh, there's a third one? Oh, look, it's got that symbol on it. Yeah, this is Juggernaut, bitch! Candy! Candy 20, scary fast, candy 20, scary fast, candy 20, scary fast. <laughs> Thank you so much for the bitch. You'd have to do that. So that's that symbol. So this is definitely something related to what's in the study. And now I also have a spade on it. Do they call it a spade? Shovel? Whatever. Maybe there's something else I can do. Because I can't use the... Sh can I just hit... No, it's examine. I can't just use it willy-nilly. So. Alright. Maybe I can use it on... Um, like the, the steel chains. That I've noticed. Just a thought. We're still looking good. Alright, where was the steel chain? Oh, right here. Nope. Okay. Um, I can use it maybe on this thing in the kitchen. No? Wow. Fuck. Okay. Hammer. There's nothing else in here except for the pictures. Alright, I'll go back to the, uh, the study. Take a look around at the walls. So that could be the well in the middle, I guess. He's trying to show me the symbols. I think. Jesus fuck. Let me try taking a picture. That may have done it. Oh yeah, look at that. So I'm assuming that's when I approach it. Because they were one to the left, one to the right, and one kind of in the back. So two raindrop 
Saturn? That's what I'm calling it. Two raindrop Saturn. Weird. Two raindrop Saturn. Alright, Thunderstorm, easy. Saturn. I know I can do this. Alright. So, let's find two. Yep, yeah, there's two. Uh, a raindrop. Yeah. And... Saturn? Which is on its own? This is what we use the shovel for. Grampus tools. I don't know if this is such a good idea, Luca. You broke it. Let's try it again. Nope. I can't. I can't pick that up either. Can I smash the locks with it? No. So now I gotta find another tool for the job. Shit. But maybe, now that will work to be able to cut open some stuff. Can I please share a tip? A tip? Um, as long as, I mean... Uh, yeah, you know what? Go ahead. Oh, yeah, no, of course. I figured you wouldn't have... I wouldn't have to worry about that. Jesus, fuck. Okay, still can't use that there. Hmm. Hey, where did that solar medallion... I don't think they're going to fit on here. No. But it's close, though. Maybe not. I don't know. Let's see. Okay. Solar medallion. Broken shovel. Hammer. Instant camera. Photos. Took a few extra pictures. A, a few extra, a few, just just a few. We'll discard the ones that aren't worth anything here. <clears throat> Like I said, I took a few extra pictures. Don't discard the red ones. Those are important. That's it. Okay. Anywhere, any place with Polaroids or cockroaches is a photo zone. Take photos to activate. Oh, right. Okay. It just never really said in particular. Um, but good to know. I thought I saw a cockroach over here earlier. But there's not a bunch of them here. I 
I didn't think that was going to matter. Okay. Let's continue forward regardless. Yeah, I still don't know what to do with that. Oh! Polaroids! Look at that. Well, that didn't work. Are you lying to me? Oh yeah, that was this again, I forgot. That door's locked. I guess I'll backtrack and look for other places that have some um, similar characteristics. So we took the picture of the Polaroids there. No Polaroids here. None there. We took that picture there already. Technically, we took a picture of it, but I'm going to do it one more time. Yeah, okay. My notebook is helpful. So far, good. Sister's leg picture. Mom's arm picture. Dad's head picture. Red door. That's it. Um, interesting. Okay. Uh, wait. Uh, I thought there was Polaroids for a second. Okay. So we've done that. Done that. Been through the kitchen. Can't open that door. Nothing in there. All the way down there. Yeah, no, I've got, I've got that. I just wanted to make sure I didn't miss any other areas. Now that you've mentioned that that tip, I wanted to make sure that I covered everything. There's something obviously I need to do down here past the red door. I think that's clear. And thank you for being helpful without spoiling or, um, or, or like backdoor gaming or anything like that. Yeah, we took a picture of the, these to open the door. Because all these goddamn bugs are here and that helped. So then here... Okay, got it. That's fucking awesome. Ah. I'll be your backdoor gamer. Yeah, I bet you will. I had the sign underneath it. Oh, for fuck's sakes. This, this is okay. This is fine. At least I can look down. Oh, oh Jesus, uh, fuck. Bad time to be scratching my head. God. Uh, the smell. The water is disgusting. It's probably not water, dude. Well, this looks like Outlast already. This oh, box no. is extremely rusty. I won't be able to open it easily. Of course you won't. What the fuck? Why did that just happen? It wasn't there a second ago. Yeah. Let me just search around before I try to... Okay, no. I'm not meant to deal with that. There's a red tinge coming through, too, so I think that's the, uh... Oh, I see. Officer Russell? Well, there's supposed to be different FM frequencies... Officer Cell. 
Okay. What am I supposed to do with this thing? Like, there's no button to do anything with this. Oh, it's time, baby! Oh, Fry, you made it back! Thank you for the raid. I hope, uh... I hope your evening of ghost hunting went well. Uh, this is not a spirit box, by the way. Huh. I don't know what this is supposed to be doing. And I can't cut through here. I guess I gotta do what I gotta do. Take pictures of the dark and see what's there. A box of some sort? Oh, this room is big. I don't like it. Fucking anxiety is real. so happy because I solved the puzzle and that I was not happy that I solved the puzzle. Hugs. Shit. Leave me alone. What does that mean? What does that mean? What does that mean? Officer Russell here. 
Oh, shit. June 17th, 1987, 527 a.m. I am now entering Madison Hill's basement. Hill? 1987? I can see there's a sort of well in, in the center of the room. <sighs> Looks like it's open. Mm -hmm. I'm going to investigate further, see what's on the other side of this. <coughs> God, there's a, a horrendous smell coming from down here. Oh, God. I almost can't take it. So I can't Thank see you, a goddamn thing down here. <laughs> nice. Both of you got one. Shit. I think I found the missing individuals. Uh, uh, they... They, um... They're, they're all mutilated. Oh my god. Legs. Arms. Oh, they, they're just everywhere. So I see. I can't see Madison. I don't think she's here. Oh, she's here. Uh, I gotta get out of here. Oh, God. Yeah. What was that? I, uh, no. I think I'm not alone. I think I'm not alone. I mean, There's definitely someone here. I don't like this. I don't fucking like this. Come on. Madison? Is, is that you? It was kind of Madison. Please! Show yourself! That's in order! when the officer shoots her fatally in the stomach. Don't come in any closer! Step back! Nobody said step back! She had to do it. Christ! Oh, my back! <laughs> oh, 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 got me God. so bad. Yeah. Uh, uh, where, where am I? What is this? Place? Oh, great. That woman. Is it possible that she's. So, this is. Alive? I, but when we gave Butt Cheek a shout out earlier, it was in this room. But I made sure not to look. And now I wish I did. I had to take pictures of all the fucking doors. Oh. I just open it? Oh. Like, what, he's gonna have a jump scare behind it or something? I'm pretty sure I opened up all of them. Let's okay, walk through it. I don't want to. Okay. Alright, so we'll 
We'll start at this this door and work work away to the right, I suppose. The music's getting louder. Why is the light fucking moving? Say cheese, achievement unlocked. What, I just take a bunch of unnecessary fucking pictures? I feel like I've... Whichever one made the fucking light move up ahead. I gotta hit that one again. I don't remember which one it was. them made the light move though. I swear I saw it move. That one. Okay. Alright, so this one right here. Why did the door open? I'm doing what you're telling me to do, Light. Now you calm down. Oh, hello. So what is that touching over here? Either one of these two. Alright, Light, you're starting to confuse the fuck out of me here. Do I have to actually sit here and develop them? Oh, I do. I was beating the shit out of his ball bag. Yeah, you were. Oh, music's getting louder again. Take a picture of this one and then actually do the thing. Pick a door and just run. I don't think it works that way because if it's dark, normally I can't go too far. Oh, we have to take a picture of the door while it's open. No. 
the fact that Uh, I'm pretty scared too. <laughs> like, something is going to happen, and I am not ready for it. All right, just to make you feel good about yourself, buddy, old pal. We're just gonna run backwards or something. Oh, okay, I must have hit a wall. All right, so it doesn't really, it's just a big open room. There. So you still want me to take pictures of these doors? Like what? I can't really use anything. Take a picture of the light, maybe? Nope. Uh, hey, old man, I need a Discord link. I had to empty out my account because someone had got into it, and I wanted to make sure it caused no harm, and I got it back. Oh, sure. If you give uh, exclamation point Discord, oh, never mind. Fries on top of it. Oh. This one is quite interesting. So, like, I get it. It's telling me those two. Like, do I take a picture of the ground because that's where the Polaroids are? I don't think so. This is... Do I just open all the doors? Is that just what I do? Well, actually, let's start with the obvious part. Let's only open the doors this thing tells us to open. So the one across from here we need to open. Yeah? Now this one? Now we're above that one. Okay. And then I guess uh, you're going to tell me by me taking pictures of the next ones? Okay. We need Dolores vibes. Okay. And then I guess it doesn't really matter which one here. So, boom. And boom. Okay. That's one way to tell me I got the answer wrong. And they're all locked. Shit. Alright, now it's picture time. from here I think here no is this one you're howarded
Oh my god! Welcome back, achievement unlocked. Glad to be back. Fuck that door. Fuck. Right. Oh my god. Not again. The attic. I don't understand. Oh, so he's hearing voices now. Open notebook. Ah, yes. To the attic, wherever the fuck that is. Which is not here, because this is the basement. Alright, we're back in the house again. Why does this frame look different from everybody else? Anything special out of that? No. So I, I didn't get anything new while I was down there. Oh, the moon box. But I can't open it. Because it's super... Wait, what was that? Madison, one, two, three, four. At the moon. What was on the other one? What's behind door number two? <laughs> we got that answer pretty easily. So wasn't there a, uh, the combination to this door back here? Is there a symbol? Anywhere around here? Just the negative one. And a bunch of other fucking numbers. That I don't even think are relevant. <sighs> Fuck. Okay. Because I remember the other box that I have has a combination on it. Actually, it's in here. Alright, let's store the moon box. We'll keep everything else here for now, I suppose. Well, solar medallion, I don't really know. No, well, maybe it'll be in the attic, though, that I need to use it. I should hold on to it. But. I have, oh, it's the moon box and the sun box. Okay. Moon box and sun box. Lots of, uh. St Stars and planets and whatnot. Very astrological. Okay, so how do we get to the attic? There's gotta be... Oh. Jesus, fuck me, dude. Guess I'll go around. Okay. Attics are never sketchy, ever. This would be no problem at all. Do you taste the sarcasm in that, everybody? I lit it on pretty fucking thick. This is huge. I've never been here before. Of course you have. What's with all the fucking math on the walls? Age is just a number. You can add or subtract. But at the end of the day, when the time comes, you die anyways. Well, alright, remember that little hint. Add or subtract. Another one of these cuckoo clocks. Yeah, that's why everyone's doing add and, sub add and subtract up here, all over the fucking walls. 
That chandelier is gonna fucking fall. I am almost ready for it. Oh, I'll use this on it. Nope. Hammer? Nope. Nothing. Great. Oh, look what we have here. Oh, what's this? The shape of this portrait is quite strange. Yeah, it's a diagonal. Giov Giovina Maxwell, 56 years old. Assuming that's my grandmother? I'll just take that. Oh, yeah, it goes right here. That was easy. Now I'm to take a Bugai picture of it. Nights. Bugai Nights. <laughs> that time to scare myself. Or not. I saw the things over here and figured I'd take a picture. Huh. I take a picture of the desk, maybe? That doesn't seem right. Alice, were you lying to me? Read. Five years old, Albert Maxwell. Five years old. This one doesn't fit there. A heart key of some sort. To... What does that say? Seven, seven, seven? Alright, let me take a picture of this then. This might be it. Yep. Super helpful. Thirteen! Okay. Thirteen what? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Not all of them activate straight away. Got it. Alright, so this one goes here. Now do I take a picture of this one now? Nope. So there's another portrait somewhere that is the shape of a hexagon. And it's probably underneath that plank. Go check this out. 43. So 43 and 13. So it's either 56 or 30. Good guess on my part, I suppose. Storyline, of course. So I'm assuming the heart key probably goes to Grandma and Grandpa's room, just based upon the fact that their ages and everything like that, and numbers and heart, because they loved each other. Cool. The 43 was killed by a three-year-old woman. We saw a woman was killed by a police killed a police officer. The 43 by a police officer. The 43 was killed by a three-year-old. All right, I got the 43 part in the 13. A police officer. The 43 police officer. The 43 was killed by a three-year-old woman. We saw a woman was killed by a police killed a police officer. The 43 police officer. The 43 was killed by. It was quite enough. that one. Still can't unlock the toilet. Come on, give it to me. There we go. Where? It's a weird shaped room. <laughs> what a mess. It's fucking The entrance key should be somewhere. Why would he keep all this? Grandma died Cataracts. a long time ago. I guess not. Oh my god. Jesus. 
This should be good. Grandma's diary. Ooh. March 22nd, 1972. They say that having a diary is good for the brain. Well, we'll see how this goes for me then. March 29th, 1972. Say we went to a garage sale near the center. I found a book of very good recipes. Johnny came back happy with the book too. He was very excited about it. It was a good day indeed. April 1st, 1972. I woke up in the middle of the night. Again. I swear there was someone staring at me in the corner of the room. Oof. Yikes. April 3rd, 1972. Today I found all my jewelry scattered all around the room and my wedding ring inside the kitchen sink. I asked Johnny what he was looking for, but he swears he didn't touch a thing. April 5th, 1972. We had to bring Johnny to our bed once again. The book we bought him only causes him nightmares. We have to admit that it is a little scary, though. April 9th, 1972. All my jewels are out of place again. Cut off on my wedding ring. It was the cutest gift Albert ever gave me, but say Johnny wasn't at home. I sometimes feel as if there was someone else in the house watching every step I make. Albert tells me not to worry. He might think I'm starting to go crazy. April 10th, 1972. What a relief. I found the ring in John's room. Honestly, I don't know what to do. April 11th, 1972. I didn't get any sleep last night. I cannot get that stupid tale of the eyeless monster out of my head. Eyeless monster? I don't know why we bought him that shitty book. Oh, Sass is here. Hey, Sass. Fry, if you could give Sass a shout out, that'd be super. I haven't written for a long time these weeks. I've been from a doctor to another. Something's wrong with my eyes. I don't know what is happening to them. My sight is getting blurry each day and it hurts a lot. May 22nd. God, doctor says that I've lost about 40% of my sight these last weeks. I find it hard to read, write, watch TV, even think of other things. My pupils are kind of erasing from my eyes. Ah, uh, I, I did the same thing last time. Wait, was there? What is? I don't know what we had to do up there, but that's the room, right? We already did it. Yeah, it's, so it's the painting room. In the painting room, you take. <laughs> <laughs> Of course. Was that, um... Oh, I forgot to ask you. How did Ghost Exile go? I know you had just started playing it when I popped in the other day. May 23rd, 1972. I'm tired of medications. Nothing seems to help. I cannot stand the pain anymore. Why is this happening to me? It's extremely hard for me to move around the house with my eyes like this. <clears throat> May 23rd, 1972. I cannot stand the pain anymore. God help me, please. Join, uh, June 2nd, 1972. I'm really scared. I know there's someone in the house, but nobody believes me. I know it's true. Even though I cannot see it, I feel the presence. There's someone living among us. June 3rd, 1972. I know there's someone in the house. I heard noises all night long. I swear I heard someone breaking. I heard someone breathing while trying to get a glass of water. June 26th, 1972. I lost more than 80% of my sight. Doctors say they no longer see any solution. I don't want to be alone in the house anymore. I'm not safe here. Pretty fun once we figured out what the heck we were doing. I mean, yeah, I, I feel that. June 27th, 1972. My ring is out of place again, but it doesn't matter. Nobody will ever be able to find it now. I just hit it underneath. Oh, God. Look at her handwriting at the last day compared to the previous days. All of a sudden. Blah, blah, blah. Holy fuck. Grandma. We didn't even know we had flashlights for the first half hour of the game. Yeah, I was going to say, you, didn't, you, you couldn't figure out where they were. There are meds everywhere. Doctor is locked. <clears throat> she was this? so sick. June 26, 1972. Elizabeth Maxwell. Ocular death exam. Cataracts diagnosis. Strange type of cataract. Both eyeballs are turning completely white. The patient loses her sight progressively in short periods of time. Ocular damage percentage. Right eye 95%. Left eye 87%. We don't have to find either a sure what is happening with the patient's eyes. Please continue with the medication is up to date while we find a proper treatment. Next visit July 26th, 1972. A month later? Bro, stop making noise over there, please. What are these things? Oh, it's a little like slideshow images. Sick. That's locked. No Polaroids or bugs in this room. There's definitely a room back here or something. Interesting. Big old sliding door. Oh! 
Uranus and Neptune. Alright, so I need this one. It's gonna go over here. And then... Where is it? Yep. Oh, you can rotate them. Shit. Alright, did anyone remember the order? So I know it's Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars. So, and then... Jupiter. Uh, apparently that's Saturn. Maybe Neptune, Uranus. Which is, that's the right way. So I'm just going to find the other one. Interesting. I don't think there's much else I can do in, do in this room. What else do I have here? My inventory. Oh yeah, right. I picked up the old slides. So there's going to be something place. I can list the planets in order if you want. That would be very helpful. But I'm assuming the last piece is going to be up in the attic because I still it still says the the book says attic. Thanks, Magic School Bus. Hell yeah! <laughs> Poor Pluto. It's a planet. It's not a planet. It's a planet. Now it's a dwarf planet. Like, dwarf moon. Whatever the fuck. He's just so fucking cold out there by himself. He just wants to hang. Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune. All right, cool. And Pluto. All right, I did have the right order then. We just have to find the other piece. That's so long. Um, hey guys. That fucking statue I hate is is gone, and the fucking door's open. Well, I was going to go back up into the attic, but, uh... Nothing. Planet X, yep. What? It's open now. There's definitely someone here. Where's the phone? Is it in the kitchen? Alright, it stopped right <laughs> Jesus, fuck! <sighs> Fucking tree. Thanks for the bits, buddy. Ooh. Pick it up. I think that was another all right tape number two. Oh look it's right here the statue Ugh, I hate these statues man they're the worst is this can I open this door no do I have to take a picture of me? okay like should I take a picture of you or are you gonna are you gonna keep moving Yep. Okay. Okay. Sure thing. I hope there's hot cocoa in this game. I may need some after this. And then past Pluto, there's uh, Maki Maki, Hamea, uh, Kusau, Kusar, Orcus, Eris, and Gong Gong. Shit. Oh, fuck me! You have a fucking problem, you know that? 
You're a statue. You're not supposed to be lumped around and all that shit. Okay, I killed the music off. That piano is blocking the front door. Uh, cause of course it is. I fucking hate that. Alright, let's try this door. That fucking statue. Oh, you're telling me, dude. Am I... Am I going insane? No, you're just fucking possessed by a demon. Let it go. Found a collectible. I'm probably not gonna get all the collectibles, but I figured I'd try. You forgot... A Greger. I wasn't aware of a Greger. Well, duh. What is this? Oh! Okay, cool. All these fucking tapes over here. What the fuck is that? Oh, I can't fucking tell what it is from that far. It's like the Spanish Inquisition. You never see, you never expect it. I'm not going over there yet. No, let me deal with this shit first. Old slides. Uh. Oh, there's a little couch down here. Ah, uh, I have to take pictures of these, and eventually I'm going to find the right one. I betcha. Or not that one. <laughs> Grandma. That one. That one. Dad. No more smiles, please. <laughs> See all these achievements. These photos are pretty old. I guess I don't take a picture of these then? Going down that hallway, there was a scary bitch in there. Oh! Oh, the fucking statue's gone again. Son of a bitch. Oh, fuck. Mm. Statue, you need to go back into your room, please. Um, I don't remember where the, f where the hell did I bring those things? Maybe it was back down here. I don't remember where I put the. Where the hell did I put the the planet things? Yeah, just stay there. Wasn't the bathroom? Where did I put the other ones? I don't remember. Where did I oh! The grandparents' room. I remembered. Okay. We good, we good. Go in there now. 
Fuck you. Okay. Made it. Plug this last one in. And, uh... Yeah, Mercury should go... Wait, that's Mars? Mercury... No, Mercury and Venus. Yeah, dirty fucking... Or dirty suburb. I gotta flip them now. So now, the blue one... Is Mercury. Venus is there. Okay, we have Earth. And then we have... Mars and... Jupiter. Uranus and Neptune. Isn't that the... Oh, you have to flip that one. There it is. Hey, hey, hey! Let's use the hammer. Oh, there's the other picture for the attic! Fuck yeah. Can I just walk in? Okay. Uh, okay. Okay, okay is right, sir. Sixty-eight years old, Philomena Maxwell. Okay. Ooh. The so fuck Grandpa that? tried to contact Grandma with this thing. Is that blood? I think so, sir. That is fucked. Wait, why are there pictures? Why are there things here now? Do I have to get a picture of this? Like, no? That's weird. Let's just take a picture of Graham. Look at her fucking eyes! Holy fuck! What did I do? Did I do something? Oh! Fuck. Fucking prick. Alright, let's go back and listen to the tape. Oh, the voice recorder. No signal. Is that the statue with no head now? My god. Put tape number two in. Becoming possessed by a wicked entity is signified by a loss of control over the body, mind, and the soul. However, that is often not enough for the entity. It hungers for more. Things get much worse for the host. In these cases, possession is just the first step of the demon's plan. It is said there are those that return to our world seeking to resolve unfinished matters from their mortal lives. Mm -hmm. The victims matters? of these wicked possessions are subjected to a departure of sorts. An astral transportation, for lack of a better word. An astral what? These malicious beings force their hosts to to live moments that shouldn't be possible in a different place and time perhaps even in a different dimension altogether it's madness. it is madness it's unclear whether these transportations occur inside the mind or if the host is physically taken to some alternative reality Alternative reality? I'm losing my mind. Yeah, you are. Because you're losing it to a demon, obviously. Alright. Okay. Listen. You're in the other hall. Oh, that's because of the thing behind you. Okay. You're in the other hall. Pick up 
pick a fucking spot, okay? Let's make some room in our inventory. We're gonna store, because we're full. Tape number two, tape number one. Not that, not that, not that. Nope. Mm -mm. nope. We need to go to the attic and use that. Okay. Wait. So, what the fuck? Okay. All right. Every time I fucking change direction, that fucking statue keeps fucking moving. Fuck you. And I can't go that way to get to the attic. Shit. What the fuck is that? I have a camera, I know how to fucking use it, okay? You naked bimbo bitch. I don't want this anymore. Can I just scoot around the side over here, please? I can't. <laughs> I wish I could scoot around that. Knowing this game, a statue. Oh, God. Could you imagine that the statue just turned into that and then the change is back? I get close enough. Yeah, like, clearly I need to get close enough to it. Just, just do it. Oh! Oh. Hexagonal photo. We're going. The problem is, I don't know if I can die or not in this game. So I don't know what to expect. Like, if when I see something like that. Circular picture as well. Yeah, here. Here's this. a good picture of this one as well. I don't have a circular one. <clears throat> 38. So we got 38 over here. We got 43 over there. We got third. No, I'm sorry. 43 is in there. 40. Yeah, 43. 13. Uh. 38. Did this one give me one yet? I don't think it did. And I don't think this one does either. No. Okay. Oh, fuck me, dude. This fucking statue. Even if this is the reason the people in uh, Phrasmophobia have jobs, this is the precursor to those jobs. Yeah, I thought the boy's age was on the back. Was it? Watch, watch, it's gonna disappear. Ready? Un fucking believable. Five. Yep. And then do we have her age? 56. Yep. Still, still, still doesn't really tell me anything now about what these numbers all mean. And now, moreover, what do we do now? Oh, can I use the... I can't use the shovel on this, can I? I don't think I can. No. Neither the hammer. Fuck. Alright, so we have a bunch of ages. What does it actually mean? Differences between all of them? I don't know. Either way, let's head back down.
I'm surprised this hasn't worked yet. Alright, let's go back through here. And we're gonna go back to the room with the uh, projector. Because I think, I think. That's still locked. That's the dad's room. Bitch isn't here again. Oh, God, stop doing that. This is the projector room, and then there's something over here. Yeah, this, this room. Let's get this over with, shall we? Oh, it's a fucking cuckoo clock. Jesus. I still don't know what to do with those things. If no one here is opposed, could you let me know what happened at the end of Martha is Dead? Um... So, uh, yeah, I, I guess if everyone's cool, we can, or if someone wants to explain it. Grandpa's office. Grandpa's office. All right, what's this? He's got two different safes here. Oh, the circular picture. 33 years old. Pasquale Maxwell. Sick. What's this? How to contact. All this time, we thought he went mad, but he only wanted to talk to her again. Instructions for the silver locket. Photo of the dead person required for accomplishing the contact. Light up some candles in the room. Turn off every light. Use your own blood as a gift to the beyond. Your blood drop must be on the right side of the locket. Close your eyes and say his, her name three times. Repeat until your loved one answers. Jesus. That's uh, a little aggressive. Oh. If you need the combination, you know where to find it. Well, that's on a clock. Which is probably on the locket. And I don't remember what fucking time that was. Joseph Abraham Lake Store. I read rune cards, tarot cards, and connect to past loved ones in the spirit world. Direction, clarification, guidance, and outcome via tarot and runes. Contact this number. Liar! <laughs> Empty. This one, too. Okay. It's pretty tame compared to the eight times we thought it was going to be over. Yeah, I think at that point we knew that she had done something and it was okay. It was really fucked up. Alright, so I'm pretty sure. So I wasn't able to take the locket, which is sucky because. I'm not going to backtrack all the way back to the locket, which is in the grandparents' room in that secret little hallway. 0451. No. My description doesn't quite do the discomfort and unease that it portrayed, though. Yeah, uh, Tree, I highly recommend checking out the VOD um, when you have time. It, it was, like, the way that you, you find out that you're actually in the asylum. You fuck off. I said fuck off. Yeah. Um... <clears throat> yeah, you figure out, like... The, like shit that happened. Alright. Back this way. Go back in here. And the locket is here. I thought there was a... Fuck. Huh. I swear there was a... There was like a picture, there was like some type of time and it was stuck. Maybe it's not in this room after all. 
Huh. Fuck out of here. Fucking statue. Oh, you are crazy, bitch, aren't you? Crazy. Is that fucked? Like that's th that's gotta be her the whole time. I still can't open up this little door. I don't know the combination to it yet. And there's the front door. We need the other fucking key. Um, how much stuff is in my inventory? Six things. Tell you what. Let's go back to the attic. Let's put the. I said fuck you. Let's put the circle uh, picture frame back up there first. That way we just get rid of stuff from our inventory and maybe it actually will trigger something. Maybe. I don't know. We'll find out. Hopefully it auto saves soon too. All right. Didn't really do much of anything, huh? Oh, I probably take a picture of it now. No. Nope. Building inspector is getting paid off. Oh, fact. Thirty-three, but that wasn't thirty-three. This is thirty-eight. Wasn't it? I don't know. It did nothing. Some sunlight. There used to be a picture there. No. Hmm. Damn. I was hoping that was gonna get us going. Like all the picture frames are up here. I didn't get an achievement unlocked or anything like that. I gotta find something that, uh, basically a clock that stopped working somewhere, and that time will be the combination. Is there any reason why you're standing right there, statue? God damn it. And I just hear clocks, nothing but clocks in there. Hook's worst nightmare. Like Captain Hook, that is. Alright, so this one's been moving. And there's nothing down that way that's going to be helpful. No clock in here. And I can't do anything to this. Double check the basement. See if I can actually go back through the red door again, maybe? I mean, I'm assuming no, but... This game reminds me of Visage. Yep. That's a lot of people told me that because I enjoyed Visage, I'd probably enjoy this game. Uh, and Baloney Boy, who if you, uh, if you watch the same TBD jump scare compilation videos, he's in there quite a bit, too. Nope. Red door's locked now. Okay. So that little area is now... No bueno. So where the fuck? Enjoy. Yes. There has to be a clock somewhere that I'm just not seeing. No, not there. Unless it has to do with the cuckoo clocks. 
And it could be the cuckoo clock outside of his office. Mmm. Mmm. Only thing I can think of, really. All right, so, yeah, so here's the cuckoo clock. So that to me looks like 7:45. So is that right seven, left four? Right five. I'll oh, so try that. Seven. Wait, hold on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. No? Okay. I don't really understand how that's going to work. If you need the combination, you know where to find it. Hmm. If anyone's got any ideas, let me know. And this one, I just don't know at all. Or it could be... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four. Two, three, four, five. Okay, no. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. No. The fuck was that? Let's say there's no fucking zoom button, so this is the best zoom I can do right here. Yep, nope, can't tell. Huh. Shit. We know where to find it. I don't understand anything about these fucking cuckoo clocks either. Also, I wonder if these cuckoo there's a lot of cuckoo clocks. I wonder if um they're related to the sun and moon boxes with the combinations underneath them. I feel like there's another clock somewhere like you thought, but I can't remember where. <laughs> Jesus. And the other thing, too, is the latest notebook still says Attic. This one keeps moving. else to do there. There's no clocks around here. 
Hmm. You know what? I'm going to check in here just in case. I won't be able to go back. Okay. I was just hoping to see if I'd be able to find anything hidden in here that I didn't notice on my way out. And there's definitely nothing. So we need to keep that door open. And there's nothing here, and I'm waiting for the other... I gotta find the triangle key. So I unlocked one of them. Did this. This cuckoo clock says 7.40, so it's five minutes before, oh no, technically it's, that's 6.40, it's before seven. Fuck off? Maybe? starting to hurt. God damn it. I feel like I'm getting tendonitis or carpal tunnel, one or the other. Specifically my left arm, forearm area. Here's another one. And this one is 510. I still can't unlock this thing. This has no signal on it, apparently. Which is weird, because it was fucking ringing. I have my armrest on my chair, and then I have, um... Well, technically I don't, it's just a big-ass, like, mouse pad. But, like, I usually have it so it's either just level or slightly above just so my arm isn't doing this the whole time. But I also don't want it doing this. So like, this has been pretty good, but. <sighs> Basement's closed. Wasn't this like one o'clock before? Why is it almost midnight? I had to get a strip pad. Maybe I'll get one. I have next month my um my new armrests come in. Cause they're like they're just they're just magnetic pieces. Uh oh wait a minute. Nine o'clock on the dot. Two that. minutes to midnight, the hands that threaten God, doom. Two minutes to midnight to kill the unborn in the womb. <sighs> Thank you. So, it was nine o'clock on the dot, eight seconds. Alice, I'm doing all right. I just found, um, I forgot I had to find this locket. And this definitely has a combination on it. But the problem is, I don't know how to. I don't really know how to enter it. Like, do I look at this as is, as if it's the combination itself, or am I looking at it saying like it's nine o o o seven?
head back there now. See if we can try this out a bit more. Oh, maybe it was eight? Okay. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Then go back to zero. Then go... Eight. No. I just, I don't understand how to... Combination the O nine O O O eight, wouldn't it not? We've been going the wrong way. Hold on, start again. Maybe I have to do it backwards, like seconds, minutes, hours. I'm not following this at all. That clue, I didn't think that clue was very helpful. Like, you know where to find it. Okay, I found it. Combination is obviously so much you perform about that time. Unless it's just legit nine, one, two, as in 12. And eight. Nine. One. Two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No. I go the other way, though. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One. Two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No. Alice, my champion, where am I going wrong here? We found the pocket watch where the time stopped at uh, eight seconds after the nine o'clock hour. And all we have here is that if I need a combination, you know where to find it. Well, you're completely wrong, Jug. You don't know what you're talking about, Jug. Oh, God. Don't tell me it's the amount of letters in the words combination and find it and then 10. Oh, well, thank you. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 10. So 11, 6, 10. Let's try that. No. Are 
Well, I wasn't doing it right anyways. Eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, and then ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. No. Alice, I need help. I've left this. I've left this to be honest. The, I might get a better hint later. There's a room full of clocks, etc. Yeah, I've I've heard that. I've heard that room. All right. I can show you exactly what that room is. It's back on the other side of this hallway. Is that bitch here? No. So, because I found this, thinking it was related to that time. You're telling me no. So that means we're talking about this. With all the clocks in here. And that clock... This one is consistently... Well, now it's the same. So I guess I'm confused then, because this clock, like, earlier was like at 1.30, but now it keeps being like, roughly the same time. Maybe it's stuck like this now, because I've activated that puzzle. But I'm still confused as to, how would I enter this in? just changed. I'm going to sit here and watch it. The attic, we have all four pictures up there. But it didn't do anything. We have a bunch of numbers related to the ages of the people on the pictures. Yep, it just changed again. So the minute hand is moving. Read, read the picture again on the table. What table? Like, which room? Up in the attic? Okay. That's the first one up here on the right. Yeah, they add and subtract stuff, and it's written all over the fucking walls. Age is just a number you can add or subtract, but at the end of the day, when the time comes, you die anyways. So we have all the ages in the room. You can add or subtract, but at the end of the day, which is, what, 11.59, when that time comes, you die anyways. I guess it'll be midnight, too. And that's just not... I, I'm not gathering. Like, I'm, what am I supposed to add? What am I supposed to subtract? And what does that mean at the end of the day in terms of a combination? And how does that relate to the clock on that door? And does it have to do with the number 43 somehow? Like, so you've seen the ages on the back of them? Yes. He's five. This guy, I think, is 33. Yep. Five, 33. 56. 68. And there's 43 back there. And I still can't get into whatever the fuck's down there. And I can't figure out how to get the cuckoo clocks to work. Remember how when it gave you a photo of the blank wall, it gave you a number? 
Yes. We have a few. I think we have a couple of those. Oh, I probably have to take these pictures down. And then take the picture. Because I didn't have that before. Because I put the picture up first. So this one's a 10. So 56 and 10 is one of them. This one was 13. Yep. So 68 and 13. And this one was 25. Okay. 25 and 5. And this one is 38 and 33. 43 is your main number. Add or subtract using the ages. I, I don't understand what I'm trying to get to. Noxler with a host? My word! Welcome in, buddy. How was your Phasmo excursion this evening? I think we were playing some Tarkov at the end, too. Raid! What up, Twy? Um, so, Alice. So, yeah, so I get 38... So, 38 was the picture behind... Uh, is, is the, the one I took the picture of. And then 5 is this particular portrait on the back. So, that equals 43. I get that. I was playing both. So, it still doesn't... It still doesn't equate what that means in terms of a combination having to do with time. <laughs> Fancy seeing you here. Do this for the rest now? Okay, so 10. No. Hope you have a great stream, Chuck. Much thank you, thank you. yeah. Go get some sleep for sure. Don't think of the clock. Oh, then it so it just throws you off then. So fifty six minus thirteen. Okay, so fifty six. Wait, fifty yeah, fifty six years old minus the thirteen behind here. Oh, Wheeler, thank you. <laughs> that is good. Okay, so, yeah, so 56 on portrait, 13 behind here. Great. So, so 56 and 13, we've got 38 and 5. I'm still not I'm still not gathering how that equals to a combination that has 12 slots on it. Like I can I, I do I spin it forever 56 fucking times? Like uh, I guess it could be 5 6 But I mean
what is it? Five, six, one, three, six, three, one, three. This is a different puzzle, I think. It's separate to the lock. See, I. That's what I was saying, and you said don't think of the clock. <laughs> oh, damn it. All right. <laughs> this is for the bricks? What fucking bricks? These bricks? Oh, the back here? Okay. I don't know what I can do with bricks here. There's no action anywhere except to look through. Ooh, what's that? Something over there. Yeah, I'm just, I'm not, I'm not gathering what I'm supposed to be doing with these numbers. Like, where am I inputting them? I don't, there's, there's, there's something that's missing here. Is there, is there something else in this room that I'm supposed to be looking at that's going to help explain what to do with these, with these math equations? Because right now I'm not, there, there's a detail that's missing that I can't put, to, I can't put together. And that chandelier is fucking obnoxious. So you finished the age puzzle. I, I have no idea if I finished the age puzzle. I don't know where I'm... Like, I, I've, I've looked. I go, okay, I've done the math here. I have now figured out two answers. Are there three? Are there four? Are there infinite? I don't know. I, regardless, if I'm doing like 38 plus 5 is 43, like, where am I... How do I input it? Where do I put these numbers? Do I hang the pictures up in a different spot from where they're supposed to be? Like, maybe. Perhaps. I mean, we could try that. Like, 30... I could do, like, the 38 plus... But then I... I... So here's the 5. But I, I can't move the 38, because the 38 was a, isn't this. This guy's 33. When I took a picture behind it, it said 38. The hanging pictures match the writing on the wall. So the five-year-old goes where the 38 is. Oh, okay. I gotcha. I gotcha. Thank you. Then, see, I wasn't... I didn't know if I was supposed to do, like, you have to go across from each other. And, okay. Okay. That wasn't, it's not very well, um, explained. You explained it well enough without just telling me until you had to. So that goes here. Because 38 and 5 makes 43. This one was, um, fuck, which one was this one again? This was 13? No, 25. So 25 plus or subtract. F fucking arm. Um, we get to 43. 43. So subtract 25 from a number. Yep, this one. This one goes here. Okay. This one was 13. Yep. This one goes here. And then obviously the last one has to go here, so. Ooh, yeah, all right. Oh, there's a door. Oh, shit. Oh, 
clock steam. this. Oh, fuck this. <laughs> All right. It is 1230. Um... We just hit an auto save here. Um, as we as this brick wall blew open, um, my arm's starting to fucking kill me. I gotta figure out how to make this stop. Like it's not the chair because I've had this chair for a couple months now. Um, it's just been recent, and I don't know why. Regardless. Um, we have been streaming now for over three and a half hours. Wow. 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 Yeah, I, I'm honestly enjoying it. That that puzzle, though, is just a little out there for me. Um, the explanation was a little lacking. Um, especially, I, I got myself all thrown off looking for that safe information, too, which is not helpful um quit please thank you i have to hit quit twice that's silly okay so um no thank you for coming in alice thank you for uh being so talkative in chat and in helping because uh, I definitely needed it on that one that puzzle at the end there for sure um, And the tips were nice too uh, The fucking tier one subscription you didn't have to do that. Thank you for that uh, Fry thank you for your raid Noxler. Thank you for your raid um, Twy is definitely a big reason why I'm playing this game as, as is fry and a bunch of others uh so yeah, I'm definitely liking it. I'm gonna keep, gonna keep playing this game for sure. Um, now, tomorrow night, I'm gonna try to play. I have some things going on tomorrow after work. Um, as long as it's not too late, I think we can definitely uh, get some uh, another couple hours in on this game for sure. Uh, but yeah, so far, definitely some, uh, some Visage um, feels. Some really fucking terrifying moments for sure uh, that I've really enjoyed. So I look forward to see what comes next. Uh, but what's next for us in particular, that's going to be who the hell are we going to send all of you over to? Oh, we got Foresights is playing Mask of Deception. Uh, Max Bex is playing The Cycle Frontier. Uh, G Rope's playing Fall Guys. Michael Exile's playing Evil Dead the game. Diana's playing games and demos. That could be a whatever. Fishboat's on playing Rust. Yeah, that's that's all I got for right now, it looks like. I don't see anybody else on the that, that account there. Hmm. Let's see. Max is playing this cycle. Forces Mask of Deception. Da, 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 da. Um, let's get to Diana. I haven't raided her in a while. So let me. Oh, of course. I don't. I have a fucking advertisement. <laughs> God damn it! I thought I was sub to her. Oh, she just changed it. So she's going to be playing Man of Madan, the Dark Pictures Anthology. Um, I played the first hour or so of that with Doc Islands. We never got back around to it. We were playing it off stream. I was going to do a recording and make a YouTube video out of it like got two years ago. Never really happened. <laughs> but uh, it looked it, yeah, yeah I, I looked like it was a good game. I was enjoying it. So um, let's send everybody over there. Uh, 
Yes, I've heard the quarry was very good. It is on my list of things to eventually play. I just didn't feel like dropping 60 bucks on it. Um, but everyone I know that's played it said they really enjoyed it. Uh, so yeah, so let's let's hook up hook us up here with a nice raid over to Diana playing Man of Badan from the Dark Pictures anthology. Um, I am going to go past the fuck out. Uh, this week's going to be an interesting week for me at the full-time job. Um, so I'm going to be looking forward to playing this game at night to kind of like revitalize and do my thing. So appreciate everyone that came by tonight. Um, thanks for watching The End of Martha is Dead. Fucked up game. And thank you for sticking around for Madison. I'm looking forward to see how it goes moving forward. Until uh, next time, sleep well, be healthy, you know... Do all the things. All the things. Have a good night. Goodbye. Bye-bye. Yeah.